This is an Arizona's Family News Update. Good morning, everyone. I'm Tess Raffles. Here are the latest stories we're following from the Arizona's Family Newsroom. Two people are dead. Four fire crews had to go to the hospital. This after a hazmat situation at an Avondale truck wash. Fire crews tell us this happened yesterday afternoon when two men associated with the truck wash were cleaning the inside of a tractor trailer container. The men sadly never made it out alive. Avondale Fire was called to the truck wash. They performed what they call a full hazmat entry and body recovery. So the area itself, uh, there was not a hazmat uh, release or exposure. Uh, the, two, uh, crew, the two individuals uh, were succumbed by the gases inside the tank that were contained. So there is not a hazmat release. It's not a hazmat uh, leak. It took two hours to recover the bodies. And in that time, four firefighters suffered from heat related issues. They were rushed to the hospital. We're told the container was empty and was at the truck wash for cleaning. Avondale police have taken over the investigation. Federal authorities have run into delays while investigating the cause of an explosion at a Chandler strip mall print shop. Four men you'll recall were badly burned in the blast last Thursday. Now ATF agents say the agency's national response team can't go into the building until its walls are deemed structurally sound. The cause of that explosion remains under investigation, but ATF teams and arsons explosive experts at the platinum printing site uh, say they are making sure they leave no stone unturned in their investigation. Happy Monday, meteorologist Kim Quintero here. We are looking at partly cloudy skies today, a high of 106. We do have a 30% chance of storms tonight with a low of 83 degrees. A flash flood watch takes an effect Tuesday at 11 a.m. does not expire until Thursday at 5 a.m. During this time, we could pick up anywhere from one to two inches of rain with thunderstorms that could lead to some flooding for those low lying areas. Temperatures are going to drop down to the 90s as we head into Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. Solid storm chances pretty much each day throughout this week. Here we go. Thank you, Kimmy. For updates on more stories we're following, you can download our app and be sure to subscribe to our YouTube and Roku channels. I'm Tess Raffles. Make it a great Monday, everybody.